question. The city is facing a major deficit this year. What is your experience or expertise that will equip you to deal with this crisis? I'm first? Yes. So um, I, have, uh, I have tremendous experience to deal with it, actually, just coming out of uh, uh, bankruptcy with the school district. The, the problems that the city budget faces right now are really on par with what we faced uh, as a school district, we've got a general fund, uh, LAD redevelopment deficit of $50 million, plus there was $75 million in the reserve a couple of years ago that's not de now down to $10 million. Uh, some of the things that we did very uh, well, I thought, were to open a, offer a, a, golden parish, a golden handshake to employees. Obviously, uh, during this time when 75% of the employees in the city live here, we don't want people on the street. So the extent that we can encourage people to go and try to move people into the positions that they're leaving, that's the best of all possible worlds. I think uh, the mayor's idea that we're going to have to eliminate up to 200 and maybe more positions is absolutely right. We can't, pay, we can't pay for the number of employees that we have. Thank you. Ms. Kaplan. Yes. First of all, I think it's important to make clear that it wasn't just discovered the last month that Oakland has a budget crisis. When the budget was released over a year ago, it said right in it that there would be extensive mid-cycle re-evaluations necessary and made it quite clear that we had a budget deficit much bigger than the $15 million that was publicly acknowledged. And just like John McCain discovered last week that we have a foreclosure crisis, we have to not pretend that we didn't know that Oakland's budget was in serious trouble. Now, I have served as an elected official on the AC Transit Board for the last six and a half years. And in that capacity, I have had to do the hard work of balancing budgets in incredibly tough times and balancing competing needs. And it's not easy, but we can do it. I've worked to secure additional outside funding. I've gone to Sacramento to lobby. I've helped pass ballot measures. And I've overseen the cuts that were necessary. And AC Transit has a balanced budget. Thank you. Can I offer a rebuttal to that? Sure. I was uh, at a budget workshop Tuesday. There were hundreds and hundreds of people in the room. I think I was the only person in the room who wasn't actually paid to be there because there was lots of staffers, there were lots of people from the union, there were lots of people who do business with the city. And the mayor made abundantly clear that this was a long, this had been something that was long overdue. He, I thought he did actually a very good job at illuminating what the crisis was, where it came from, how long we had known, and uh, those, kind of, um, those kind of issues. I, I don't think there's any... Uh, need to or or desire to cover anything up. I think in all fairness, we should give you a chance, Ms. Kaplan, to re for rebuttal if you want. Um, well, I, I certainly uh, was not claiming that anything was covered up at the meeting this Tuesday. What I'm saying is that when this budget came out last year, it was reported that Oakland had only a $15 million budget deficit when at the time, if one read the budget, it would have been obvious that it was much bigger than that back last year. Thank you. All right, now we